Um, when I was when I was going through things. Uh, you know, when, when my grandpa died, there, there was, there was these weird layers of, um, of, of, of feelings, I guess, um, and <laughs> the only way I know how to describe it is, I mean, the beginning there was madness there there was there was sadness there was madness there was confusion and then the middle part was like was going crazy you know i wanted to hurt myself you know i saw i saw him how i you would usually see him then I saw him on the floor then I saw him in the ambulance then I saw him in the hospital bed and then I saw him in the casket and then I saw him closing the casket and then I saw us carrying him to the hearse then then I saw him getting put six feet under and you know watching the man that I love and I grew up with every single day of my life Hey, even when I didn't see him, I still talked to him, but seeing him slowly rot away and decay and I, I was I was in a dark place. Uh, uh, with the things I was saying on online, it, it, it was it was crazy, you know. And, you know, I just really wasn't myself and I started taking my medicine. And that really helped me, you know, like, but that is, that's fighting my demons, that's, uh, that's, that's me fighting, that's me fighting to get to a place where I, I can be happy, I can be me, I can truly be me, and I can let go of everything I've done in the past, every bad thing that I've ever done, you know, and, you know, and also letting go of this 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 anger and, and and these thoughts that I had, and it was one hell of a fight, and and I did fight for it, you know, mentally and physically, you know, and I would just talk to myself, I would talk to myself through it, and I would be like, yo, do this, do that, get your mind off of stuff, don't be like this, don't be like that, because it really woke me up. It. It, it woke me up to something that I didn't know I could do. It woke me up to like, yo, you can't keep going down the same route that you're going. You have to change for yourself, for, you, for your family, for others. You gotta put in that work and you gotta fucking move on. You gotta fucking fight for it. You know, I would, I would sit talking to my friends, you know, they helped me out a lot, you know. You know, just listening to music, being happy, going to work, you know, interacting with people. That was amazing. I was happiest, most, it's, it's the most I felt good. I felt happy. I felt pleased with where I was. And I hate saying that, but at the same time, I don't because I was happy. Even after all that happened... I'm happy that I found who I am and what I want to do in my life. In which direction I want to go. I, uh, I had to move on. And I did move on. And now, you know, after like two years, I... I moved on. I'm happy where I'm at right now. I couldn't... I couldn't ask for anything... Anything more. You know, I've changed as a person. I've, I've endured a lot. I've become a lot. You know, I, I'm happy... I'm happy that I'm not the way I was. 
I'm happy I'm the way I am. And it was kind of like life was an hourglass. Life is an hourglass. When you're born, your hourglass gets flipped over. You gotta live your life. And right in the middle of that hourglass is where you where you take a shift. In the middle of that hourglass is when you shift and you become who you are now. You might not have found who you are yet, but eventually you will. You got to work for it, though. Uh, it was it was it was a change. It was a big change. It was a needed change. But eventually, I got there, and eventually, you can too. Put in the work and fight for you and fight for the other people around you, the people who love you, your friends, your family. Fuck, shit, even your fucking pets. You gotta fight for something. I know it's easier said than done. I never believed in myself. You just need to get over whatever you are dealing with. Whatever you're facing, you gotta face that shit head the fuck on. And once you get past that, that's when you start the new you. That's when you start over again. And you continue until you're happy where you're at. And you are happy with yourself and you are happy with life. Or else, you're gonna keep making the same mistake. And I kept making that same mistake, and I said, fuck that. I am making that mistake. Again. Not for the 30th thousand fucking time. You know? I... I really... I really am happy where I'm at. If... If, if you ever need help, you ever want to talk to somebody, and you feel like you can't, you can. You can. There's people out there for you. If your own family doesn't want to listen to you, somebody will. And you got to get you that help. Because nobody can help you and nobody can know what's best for you than you. You know? You got to fight for it, man. I know it's in you. You got to be seeing things clearly. Somebody loves you. Somebody cares about you. And if you don't love you and you don't care about you, then you gotta fucking find that. You gotta find how you gotta love and care for yourself. And once you do that, you'll be good. I promise you that. After that, you'll be seeing things clearly. I love you.